In this video, I'll give you a quick tour of the space I got for my new bakery. Welcome to Sweet and Myra. This can see here with Sweet and Myra. Sweet and Myra is where we provide our clients with custom made cakes and desserts from scratch. If you're new here, welcome and consider subscribing to my channel. And do not forget to turn on the notification button so that you know when I put out any new content. Y'all, this calls for celebration. I just signed a lease and picked up my keys for this space that I got for my new bakery. So what I want to do today is to give you all a quick tour of what the space looks like, at least before building anything on it. You know what? I'm going to carry you all along every step of the way from start to finish of the building of this bakery the licensing the state requirements whatever is required of me to get this bakery up and running the whole essence of this is to empower anyone that is looking at starting a new business um, or a commercial kitchen or even a bakery this will help limit whatever stress you have to go through as you i mean if you're watching if you are gonna be doing any of this stuff and you're watching this video it will help eliminate whatever whatever mistake you will make uh, because i will show you everything i would tell you whatever is required of you to do to get this bakery running okay y'all as you come into the entrance of this space the first thing you will see it's right here this is the entrance of the bakery this is probably the front desk or whatever you want to call it but um let me give you a quick history of this space this space was um i think someone started building out this space for a bakery the person wanted to use it for a bakery started building out all the structures you see around here but could not continue the person had to quit along the way for the reason I don't know I um, anyway that is not the business of today let me just keep taking you uh, 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 along the around everywhere to see what this space looks like and um, as you can see okay let's let me turn on the light because here it's a bit dark let me go ahead and turn on the light now the light is on so if you look closely you will see that the floor has um this is this is um a new floor the ties have been um put here um they are pretty new ties and i mean if you mop this space you will see that they are 
pretty new ties. But the issue I have with this space is this is not my style. I wouldn't be going for a black or dark ties. I don't know. This is not me here. I really hope this is not going to cost me double or triple the price to get this place um, changed to my style. Anyway, um, if you, as you can see, this, um, a lot of structures has been put in here, but this is not my style. I'm so sorry. This is not my style. This is not me right here. I have a concept of what I would want my bakery to look like. And I, to be honest with you, I really want to put portray that concept so everything you see here is just not me and I might likely have them pulled down and um, I don't know I don't know I might likely have most of the stuff you see here pulled down because this is not this is just not me so that's it the floor is pretty. I'm not saying it's not it's not good. It's pretty, but this is not what I want my bakery to look like. So let's um I don't know, but um as we go along, y'all will see what I really um the way I want my bakery to look like. I mean, you will see everything you would. I think you will um, see what I'm talking about. Uh, you will see my concept. So let's see if we can get into the kitchen. Now this is going to be the kitchen, the commercial kitchen. I'm so excited. They already started building the, the structures for the vent tube and the walk-in closet. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Why did I say closet? Am I looking at getting a new closet? No. Walk-in cooler. As you can see, this is the walk-in cooler and this is the vent tube. What you see here, they they are just the structures. They are not working yet. For me to use this vent tube and the walk-in cooler, I will have to install for the working cooler. I have to install the the uh, cooling fans to get it to to be working uh, properly. And for the vent tube, I will have to install the vent tube um, because what you see is just the structure, which is really a good thing for me. Um, part of the work has been done, but not 100% of the work. So for me to use this tooth stuff, I will have to install the real thing to get it working. Um, so this is what the kitchen looks like. I am excited. Okay, this is the kitchen ceiling. And this is the exit. Let's see if this video can take us in. Okay, let's get into the working cooler. Now, this is what the working cooler looks like. I think um, the cooling fans might be the stuff you see on the floor, but I don't think these ones are working. So for me to use this space, this cooling cooler as a cooling cooler, I would have to uh, get the um, cooling fans and install them in it. So this is what the inside looks like. Um, yo, this place has, this place has been ignored for, I don't know, for years. That is why they are, it's all looking this way. But we'll take care of it. Everything here, it's meant to be new. 
but he's just been lying he's just been lying here for years that's why they're all looking uh rusty dusty uh what have you so um, let's keep looking around this is this is the electrical um i think this is the electrical corner of the space um oh, we will not mess with that area right so this is what the kitchen ceiling looks like some stuff has been installed and the, 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 let's just keep moving around video keep taking us around let's see what this space looks like yo i i can't tell you how excited i am to um to get this space so this is the vent hood let's see if we can see inside this helps to eliminate whatever smoke you have going in your commercial kitchen so this um, you know there's the kitchen ceiling here's what it looks like yeah 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 okay there's the walking cooler there's the venture Yes. Yes. Oh. Yo, this is my big queen. Trust me, you will love this place by the time we are done building. Don't forget that the next step is for the architect, which I have invited to come in and do the drawing the state will never let you build out anything until the architect draws exactly what the bakery is gonna look like and send it to the state upon state approval we will start building so and this takes um a few weeks um over a month i was told so I hope you will not be worried if you don't see any video concerning this bakery coming too soon because as as soon as we are approved to build I will come again and shoot out a new video and tell you what is going on so just know that I'm gonna keep updating y'all of everything going on so let's walk into the restroom this is what the restroom looks This is the restroom. This is the restroom sink. <laughs> Look, I don't know why I'm sounding like this, but I don't know. You might, you might say it's part of the assignment, but that's okay. Whatever you want to call it, it really doesn't matter at this time. What matters is that we are taking a tour of this bakery. Oh, look at it. Look. Look at it, y'all. Look at it. Look at the pretty floor. This floor is pretty i really hope i just wish i can keep this floor but this is not me this is not me this floor is not me okay well let's see how it goes let's see how it goes okay y'all this is it this is it this is it. This is it. This, this this place is quite big. I'm excited, y'all. I'm excited. Okay, 
thank you for watching and make sure to keep tuning in for more updates of my new bakery make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you love what you're saying and i will see y'all on the other side thanks and god bless